Charlie, last time we talked, uh, we had a very interesting, somewhat, interaction. I asked you about the Bilderberg Group and your participation in the Bilderberg Group, and I asked you what was happening in there since there was major decisions made according to many leaked documents that did come true. Uh, can you at least give us some insight about what happens at this secretive, I, elusive I meeting? That, uh, have, does, I've never seen anything happen there that, that I have not seen happen at every other conference I've ever gone to. But David Yon brags that the secret group created the Euro. I don't know. No. I, I remember. Yes, he did. I, he admitted that. But I don't know about that, I'm saying. I'm just saying that nothing... Uh, for me, it's a learning experience for all the conferences I go to. And, and most of the... I see a, a lot of the same people at the conferences, uh, whether they're from uh, business or politics or journalism. Do you think it's fair for the elites to collude together in secret I, and I, then I, I, the no, world I, decisions I, being made with the world most powerful influential people I, and media? I, I, I do not think it's fair to people to collude. Okay. But that's what you do when you go there. I mean, well, I go to a lot of conferences where I think I can learn something. Okay. If you could just continue this conversation, this is Luke again. You said you learned a lot at the Bilderberg Group. I was wondering what what did you learn? We can walk and talk. We'll make this really quick. Sorry, but what did you learn? What I said to you is I'm constantly going to all kinds of conferences to learn from a whole range of people who have a lot to say. I just want to know specifically what you learned at the Bilderberg meeting since there's so much secrecy behind it. I don't know how much secrecy there is behind it. Most of the people I see at most conferences, including Bilderberg, are people that you know and interview all the time. But they usually run away when they don't want to talk about it. But were you there when uh, David Yon said that he created the euro? He said that to the EU observer. He said that to the EU observer that this secret group created the euro. I mean, it doesn't seem like a regular conference. I don't remember that no. Condoleezza Rice dis- uh, decided her missile defense systems there as well uh, with the Czech Republic. I was not there for that. Henry Kissinger selected John Edwards to be uh, John Kerry's VP. That's all admitted at the secret conference. And I'm just saying it's just weird. You know? I, I was not there. But I said you were there. All right. Thank you, Charlie. Thank you. I'm such a big fan of yours. Just one question, very important. What did you do at the Bilderberg meeting, meeting with world's elites in secret in Chantilly, Virginia, 2008, this year, last year? Sir, Mr. Rose, can you please answer the question? You not answer this question shows that you don't want to answer it, sir. What happens? We have a discussion. There's an agenda and we discuss it. Barack Obama we'll put came out a report. in 2008. No, he's never been. He's never been there? No. I can just ask, why is there no press coverage of something so important? Because we don't, we don't want any press coverage. We don't, we don't have to have press coverage.